Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. As always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. I really appreciate all of your continued support in the form of likes and comments and following me over on Instagram. You guys are really the reason that I continue to do this and what make this so much fun. Today I have my second kitten and hottie box. This is a kawaii box, not to be confused with the island of kawaii, which is also near and dear to my heart, but the Japanese concept of kawaii is the idea of cuteness. It's often items that are just so adorable you want to squeeze them. It's also a very affordable subscription at just $26.99 per quarter, and they have two different boxes. You can do the harine zumi box, which is a little bit more geared towards kids, or you you can do the kid in box which is what I get which is a little bit more geared towards adults since you're gonna get some more items that have a little bit more function as well as cuteness involved I also have a coupon code for you guys even though it's already super affordable, if you use the code NOEL25, you can save 25% on your first box, which I think is awesome. So it comes in this adorable box and they were cute and creative and put some washi tape under the label. And then it's just got this little hedgehog that's sitting on top of this giraffe. So already how adorable is that? All right, let's see what we've got in our kawaii delivered box. So opening it up, they have some of those little uh, origami stars, which I love. There was a bunch in the last box. I just think they're so, so cute. What great like decorations. I'll definitely put these in some of my Instagram photos. See, they're so cute. I think it's so awesome that someone takes the time to do that. I, or they probably have a machine that it can actually do them. But I just think that's such a cute um, decoration. It's like it's like three-dimensional confetti. All right, so I guess confetti is three-dimensional, but not usually. It's right, it's just paper, and this is like little boxes. Um, this is so cute. Okay, let's, let's read the handwritten note first, because you guys know I have a handwritten note, and naturally they have like perfect kawaii handwriting. Dear Noelle, your YouTube videos and posts are so amazing. We truly appreciate the shout outs. This little whale shark eraser, yay, is a special thank you gift just for you. Thank you guys. So I know that the theme for this one is like sea creatures and I love sea creatures. I think they're so adorable, especially when they're kind of rendered in a kawaii way. Um, whale sharks are one of my fairy favorites. This is a little eraser. I will like never use them, but like I just love the smile of a whale shark, that big wide mouth they've got. Here's his little spots. He's so cute. So this was like my obsession, you guys. My husband and I were lucky enough to go to the Maldives for our honeymoon. And um, I was obsessed with seeing whale sharks because there's certain areas in the Maldives that are known for whale sharks. There's certain areas that are known for surfing. My husband was probably kind of disappointed that I chose whale sharks over surfing. But anyway, I figured honeymoon, I get to do what I want. But um, you can even go swimming with whale sharks here off the coast of Mexico if you go further south, but we had to go all the way to the other side of the world for me to get to swim with whale sharks. Anyway, my whole goal was to go on this boat trip where, you know, obviously they can't guarantee that you're going to see a whale shark, but hopefully you do. And all of my dreams came true because we hopped in the water and I like spun around with my snorkel mask on and there was a whale shark like swimming straight towards my face. And it was like the most amazing experience and he just looks so happy and probably a little bit perturbed by all of us swimming around him just like gawking but I still love whale sharks because they're just like the smiliest they're so cute all right thank you guys appreciate that all right let's get into the actual box sorry guys you had to learn about my obsession with whale sharks because you already know how much I love pineapples so it says thank you for ordering the catering box we've got this nice um, printout that tells us all about the items it doesn't have the um, retail values but that's okay so it looks like we wound up with like one double-sided sheet and then one one-sided sheet so we're gonna get into it I am so so, so excited. This under the sea themed box features some of our favorite sea creatures and is full of fun and functional items. We hope you will enjoy them as much as we enjoyed picking them out for you. So I'm sure that I will enjoy them. So then we've got a little more tissue paper, a couple more of those little box stars, which I have to be careful not to toss to the floor. And then inside, oh, I'm already seeing stuff that's adorable. It's got all this little like nesting foozles. And these are really like the small skinny shreds. So it really is more like um, 
like a bird's nest, like little wiry pieces versus like that traditional paper shred that we see in so many other boxes. Um, I, I, this box is so cute, you guys. So the first thing I'm seeing, this is another favorite of mine, narwhals. Now, when you see the real videos of narwhals, they are scary, scary animals. They are very tough and very aggressive. But when you see them in cartoon form, they're the cutest things ever because they're the unicorns of the sea. Look how cute this little pin is. And look, you guys, like they actually made this backer card. So you can see that this is actually cut out the little waves, just as one of these little pin backs. This is the cutest. So I have to get a pin board because I have some Disney pins. You guys know if you watch my Disney videos, I have a pin board, but I get so many cute enamel pins now in subscription boxes. And I definitely need to have a place to display them because this guy is going up on it immediately. So let me just find him on the sheet. So this is our narwhal pin, also known as Unicorns of the Sea. We think that narwhals are magical and majestic creatures. These pins are pretty magical too. I totally agree. I love that. All right, so <laughs> I'm just going with like the things that I think are the cutest. This is so cute. This is a little keychain and it is a crocheted whale. Look at him. Look at his little tail. It's like a little stub. So cute. I think that's amazing. Little, little beady eyes. That is so adorable, you guys. Okay. So it looks like you could have gotten it in blue or pink. I'm glad I got the blue. And it's kind of like this like deep teal blue instead of pink. This is, says it is an amigurumi whale. <laughs> I think maybe that means crocheted. I don't know. So you, so you could have gotten pink. When times are tough, remember to just keep swimming. Another exclusive handmade item in this month's box is this mini Ami Amigurumi whale, the perfect size for a keychain. So I love crocheted things. Like there are some boxes that I have subscribed to just because of the crocheted item that's in it. Uh, and this would be no exception. I would totally have gotten this box just for this little whale -yo. So cute. All right, keep going. Another, you know what another adorable sea creature is, you guys? otters. I can watch otters forever. When <laughs> I went to the Monterey Bay Aquarium and of course they have otters and I can just watch them like munching and floating. And then when we were in Morro Bay and I realized there's so many otters, like I don't need to go to an aquarium to see them. You can just like walk along the shore and there they are being adorable. And they're like one of my favorite, favorite little guys. I, I'm saying that every sea creature is my favorite. I don't like urchins as much. Let's see. I don't like eels as much. Even when you make them cute and kawaii, they're still a little scary. So <laughs> this is a little tissue pack holder and there's a little otter guy on him. So you can see inside it's got like the tissue pack. So they actually included the tissue pack, which I think is really nice. And then it looks like we've got some other stuff kind of in the front pocket. So it's not just a tissue pack. You can put some other stuff in there. So let me find it. Let's see. It says, otter pocket tissue hand sanitizer holder great keep your tissues and hand sanitizer at the ready with this handy holder a kitten and hotty handmade exclusive the holder prevents your tissues from getting crushed at the bottom of your purse and the pocket is the perfect size for the included hand sanitizer and chapstick that is awesome you guys so we got the holder we got the tissue in there we got a little chapstick let's see it looks like it's in a flavor in cherry great and we got a little pocket hand sanitizer. It says, ooh, eucalyptus spearmint essential oils. And it's the kind that's got like some glitter in it. And I really like these. I know we've been getting a lot of like spray hand sanitizers, but I like these, these ones. These ones where you just like squirt a little bit in your hand and rub it together. I feel like it's just less waste and like they usually come in like smaller bottles like this. So this is really cute and I need to be better about having tissues. So often my husband's like, do you have a tissue or a band-aid? Cause he like expects me to have like a mom bag where I like have all those things. I'm like, do you see the size of my purse? Which is usually like this big. I'm like, I don't have all those things, but I could start maybe adding some of these things to my, to my daily purse. All right, let's see what else we've got. This says memo and pointy sticky marker, bubble time, auto oh, these are cute. So I don't know if I'll take, I'll take them out. Why not? Let's see if I can get this to open up. So these are otter sticky notes. And then it looks like we also got a pen that goes with it. So I love that they're like pairing things, things together. So look how cute. 
There are little stickies. They're little otters. So these are great for like bookmarks, obviously, or if you're still in school of some sort for taking notes. And then it comes in this little book. So you've got these little otters that like poke out of the pages. And then you've got like a regular sticky note that's also got a little otter. <laughs> he just says hello. And like that one on the bottom has a rubber ducky on his head. There's another one with like a lotion bottle in his hand there's another one with a soap bar in his hand and then there's one holding a ducky one holding a fish and one holding like a kitty and i think the kitty has a beret on like how cute is that you guys so it makes me want to go back to school my husband's always like i'm so glad i never have to go back to school and like i went to a lot of school and i would love to go back to school <laughs> i don't i don't know what degree i would go back for but maybe just for fun all right so looking oh we've got a yay we got a cord protector and it's a whaleo shark here's his little dots and his little wide mouth so of course you put this right on there so it's great for when you're charging stuff because a lot of times those cords over time get all frayed and messes it up and it looks bad and it crumbles and i have a few of them and i actually have a few that are like sea creature themed but i don't have a whale shark i have a whale i have an orca I have a like Nemo clownfish, but now I have a whale shark and he will be replacing, I have like a shark right now on my cord, but now I have a whale shark and I'm super excited about him. So I think that they actually posted him over on Instagram and I like pounced in the comments and was like, I need that. Um, so thank you for listening to me. Let me see. Oh, everybody got the whale shark. That's even better. So whale sharks are the gentle giants of the sea. Did you know that whale sharks have teeth? As filter feeders, they don't use them to eat. Slip this cutie over your phone cable to protect it from fraying. So you can kind of see. And I usually like slide it right up on the edge of the cord um, for my iPhone. So it kind of looks like he's like biting on the phone, which I think is like added cuteness. Um, let's see. We've got a pen. Oh, this is so cute. It's got a little pink penguin on it. Can you guys see the little pink penguin? He's adorable. And then it's also got like an extra um, ink ink rod. So look how cute. So it's a little clicker pen. So he just bounces up and down. It's like something that I'll just keep doing because he's so cute. And of course he's like squishy. Not like super squishy, but like rubbery like an eraser. So that's what was to go with our sticky notepad. It says these useful markers feature fun and playful otters in a bathtub. Oh, that's why they're holding soap and lotion and stuff. That makes so much more sense. The pens feature penguins, whales, seals, and dolphins. We included an extra ink refill for you too. That's so nice. Um, favorite feature, these are friction erasable. Simply rub the plastic end over your writing and watch the ink disappear. That's awesome. Ooh, the whale was cute and so was the seal. Actually, they were all cute, but I'm, I'm happy with the pink penguin. The little seal was really cute too, but it's only because he's pink that I'm like, eh, but still cute. So this little thing, I guess you can erase. Yes. Yes. I don't know. So maybe you use a regular eraser. Simply rub the plastic in. I guess the plastic actually helps erase the ink. I'm going to have to try that out. But in the meantime, I'm just going to like, it's such a satisfying sound, right? ASMR. Such a satisfying little click. All right. Let's keep going. Ooh, treats. Ooh, really good ones. So these must be from Japan because you always get interesting Kit Kat flavors in other countries. It says ocean salt. One's got some um, sea stars on it and one's got a seahorse on it. And I love Kit Kats. I love chocolate covered wafer anythings. So pretty happy about that. I think they like started melting while I was holding them. So it says ocean salt Kit Kats. These Japanese Kit Kats fit this box theme perfectly. They are white chocolate and have the perfect combination of salty and sweet. Yes, salty white chocolate does sound odd, but trust us, they are delicious. I love sweet and savory together. So I'm sure they're going to be amazing. I'm not sure that they're going to make it over to my Instagram photos because that sounds really good. Maybe one will and the other one I might have to try really soon. Anyway, I think we've got still more stuff you guys how awesome is this box for like 27 dollars, right and you can get 25 percent off with my code i think it's pretty awesome um we've got a little pouch it's very like chic color blocked on this side and then on this side it's got a sea turtle this is kame 
Look how cute he is! So sea turtles are one of those animals that is like cute in real life in the documentaries and cute when you draw it as a cartoon. So let's see what it says about this. This is a Kame turtle zip pouch. Uh, Kame is turtle in Japanese. This extra roomy pouch could probably fit everything in this month's box. We use ours for carrying around bulky laptop charge cords and phone cables to keep everything nice and neat. So I get so many pouches and all kinds of different subscription boxes but this one's actually really adorable and I love it. I might actually um, use it for, I have a bunch of different sunscreens because I got so many like sunscreens in subscription boxes this summer and it's great, but like now I don't have them like in one place. So this might be cute because again, it's kind of like beachy themed to have all of our extra sunscreens in one spot. And then we won't actually start all of them all at once, which is like a pet peeve of mine. I'm like, don't get a new sunscreen out until we finish this other sunscreen. So if I just keep all of the reserves in the cute little turtle bag, then that might be the solution to that. Um, there's still more stuff in here. I think that's actually it, but oh, there's always like a little like project. So and they have these little cute um, cat stickers. So it looks like I got some origami paper. Yeah, so like we got blue and like a green, ooh, a purple. So I'm guessing it's origami paper. I used to really like doing that. Yes, so so it's to make some origami fish. Cool. So I used to make the little like boxes like that you could like blow up, but I don't know if I remember how to do those anymore. It says angelfish origami. Watch the video tutorial on the blog section of our website to learn how to easily fold these angelfish origami. Origami is so addictive, you'll soon have a whole school of colorful fish. I'm totally gonna do that one because it'll look good on Instagram but also it's very like calming once you like learn the pattern like to just keep repetitively making a bunch of fish I think is really great and of course it's a fun decoration like you could definitely put fish up on your wall you know just as a temporary thing to give yourself that kind of sea vibe I think that's awesome and that's a very like low energy uh investment kind of activity for their craft for this season so i'm thrilled with this box you guys i will use everything in here we got that super cute tissue holder with hand sanitizer with tissue and a chapstick we got the clicker pen with uh an extra refill and the little otter sticky notes got the whale shark cable protector the turtle zip pouch two Kit Kats in a cool flavor from a different country, the narwhal pin, which might be up there with one of my favorite things, the crocheted whale, which might also be up there with my favorite things, and then the origami paper to make origami fish. Great box for $27, so cute, so fun. Lots of like functional stuff in here too in this adult box, in the kitten box. Let me know what your favorite item was. Let me know what your favorite sea creature is in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and hopefully I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.